welcome back to a new vlog. We've just arrived in York. We're staying at the Grand Hotel. This is our room. We've literally just got here. Lovely big bed. It's actually quite a big room. So this is what it's like. Really nice bathroom in here. Ta-da, it's all like marbly. So we just got here. We actually decided to get the train here. It was really easy, just all straightforward. And the Grand, if you are getting the train to York, the Grand is very close to um, the train station. So this is what I'm wearing. Got this new blouse on by Pieces at ASOS. H&M uh, jumper, mango jeans, um, Zara boots, and this H&M hat as well, and then my fur coat. I think it's about 12 now. Is it 12? 12? Yeah, literally dot on. Dot. Dot on. Um, and we're quite hungry, so I think we're going to go out in search for some food. Lunch. Luncheon. Luncheon. I'm so hungry. Shall we just kind of walk and see what we come across? Yeah. Okay. Cool, that? Mannions. Yeah, it's an eight minute walk, but that's nothing. That's nothing. <laughs> I'm so hungry, I'm sorry. I think I'm gonna have to open this shortbread before we actually set off. Should we have one before we go? Half of one. Half of one, okay. Nice, <laughs> <laughs> and they broke off half anyway. Mm. Mm. Let's go. Let's do it. There is some Insta in all its glory. So lucky with this weather. <laughs> have just had lunch well a little bit ago we've just had been walking around actually we had lunch in Mannion's which actually was delicious we thought we'd have to wait for quite a while because there was a queue but um we didn't <laughs> um yeah we thought we'd have to wait in queue what's going on Tim what is it what is it Robin. Oh, it is. Oh, how cute. Oh, baby, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, so we thought we'd have to queue for like 25 minutes in Mannion's, but actually we didn't. And it was really close to our hotel too. Scargoyle. 
Yeah, it was really close to our hotel. So we had baked camembert. We shared Ooh, baked camembert yeah. and um, bacon and brie um, sandwich, but they were both so good. I would have waited an hour for that. Oh, it was that good. It was. So definitely Literally. recommend Mannion's if you are in York. It was really yeah, delicious. Thank you, whoever recommended. Thank you, whoever recommended it. It was on my Instagram. Someone recommended it actually. We've just come to the treasurer's house now walking around the gardens we've had a mulled wine at the christmas market and now we're just having a stroll around york we're at the back of the minster basically if you've not been to york before this is the treasurer's house and the minster is right in front of us so i think we're going to walk around there and then maybe head back for another mulled wine around the market so it's like an indoor bar there so i think we might try there have a drink but it's lovely in york so far I literally couldn't be luckier with the weather could we what are you gonna say luckier with me i couldn't be luckier <laughs> couldn't, with you couldn't be luckier couldn't. with the weather <laughs> <laughs> this is my favorite house in york it's the deanery right next to the minster but it is some street crier caroling through the air and the smell of the big christmas tree hotel with all the lights on so pretty <laughs> oh it looks so lovely it's so pretty So it's evening time and I've just got ready. I'm not sure whether to keep this headband and the earrings on, but what do you think about them both? Or just one or the other? Ah, uh, yeah, the earrings are like belts. It's not very nice. Um, so this is what I'm actually wearing. It's this jumper by Weekday, which is new actually, I got this on ASOS. Lipstick is Bobbi Brown. Let's see if we can see what it is. Crushed lip colour in Lulu. And this is, I think it's part of the Betty, yeah it is, Betty Johnson range. Um, yes, yeah, so I've got this belt, belt on by ASOS, Zara leather trousers. Um, earrings are old Zara and then my headband is also Zara. But like I say, I might take one thing off. I don't actually quite like it though, so I don't know whether to. I've got some old boots on as well. You're not giving me a final decision on. Oh, you found your belt. Nice. We don't know. Where are we going to eat? We saw an Italian that um, I was recommended called. Was it Lucia? Is that what it was called? So we might go there because the one we thought we were going to go to isn't open until tomorrow. So we might go there, but there's one called, what was that, Cutten, Cut, Cutten something, the burger place. Uh, Cut, Cutten, <laughs> I don't know. I can't remember, but we might go there. I guess we'll have to see, won't we? I guess we will. Um, but yeah, this is, this is what we're doing this evening. It's about half six, had a, such a lovely day. York is so nice at this time of year. Definitely would try and get here over Christmas when and if you can. Is this your outfit? Yeah. Cute. You're like a stuffed turkey.
everyone. It's the next day. Last night we went out for something to eat. We went to Lucia's, which is like in the center of the town. And we got there, it was actually really busy, but they said there was gonna be like a 25 minute wait. So we said we'd have a drink in the bar upstairs, which was really nice. So we got a drink and then 10 minutes later, we our table was ready, which is good. Had the most delicious chicken risotto and Tim had chicken a chicken pasta if my skin looks a bit dodgy that's because it is i've put a product on i don't know what it is and it's reacted badly um again which is really annoying but anyway so this morning we're gonna go for some breakfast i'm not sure where we're going should we just walk and then see because yeah we may as well this mm. is what i'm wearing let's go to the mirror let's do a mirror outfit of the day So I've gone for winter whites today, I've got my under the stories jeans on which I've lived in since summer, well since spring actually. My Zara boots, these are the only boots I've worn but I quite like the like off white and black together. This knit by Zara and this hat by Pieces and then I'm going to put my fur coat over the top to keep me nice and warm but I think today once we've gone to breakfast we'll probably have a little walk around the walls. Do you think? And then we said we might go to the Jorvik Centre because we didn't do that last time and it's a really good place to go so we might do that. But let's go. Let's go. Let's go kids. Let's I'm go. I'm going to attack and then I'm going to go. Okay. So it's a finished look. Oh and the lights have just gone out because I've taken the card out. But I've just got my coat on and my hat. Come on Tim, let's go. Hurry up, hurry up. Do you want to jump? Uh, yeah, it's freezing. Yeah. So we've just had breakfast in a cafe which is like right outside the Minster so it was a nice little view and we've come now, we'll actually try to get on the walls but we think they're closed because it's, oh squirrel, little squirrel nutkin. He's very close. Yeah. yeah he's really close, or she. This is like Lydia's wildlife channel. <laughs> oh, look at it. <laughs> that nice. It has got red all over it, hasn't it? Maybe it's, it's a half breed. How cute is that? I love squirrels. Yeah, so we tried to get on the walls, but we think they might be closed because it's cold today. So we think because it's icy that they close them, but we might try and get up there later on we've just come to the gardens now like the park area I'm just this is a museum in the background and i'm wearing my earmuffs and if you don't like them don't comment because i don't care i don't think anyone is gonna really have an opinion on it to be honest and then i think we're gonna try and go to yorvik center feeling very full after our full yorkshire breakfast but they were really good weren't they oh it was a very good yorkshire sausage delish yeah, look at the ivy door, how lovely is that? Oh, it's gingerbread. It's a gorgeous, like a little gingerbread house. You know that the bike is going to keep themselves more gloomy, as we found many kinds of as well as the I'm walking around, feeling free, thinking about what's happened to me from July. Up till now, don't know where, don't know how. Lately, I've come to realize that I can't see it in your eyes. So oh, it's true. I'm so glad you feel it too. Nothing to hide. Falling in love to me is perfectly clear.
Christmas time's got the best on you. Had some donuts at the Christmas market. You are a donut. <laughs> at the Christmas markets. They were so good. And then we had a hot chocolate before that, so we're now trying to walk around and burn a few calories. We're not allowed to stop for three hours. We're not allowed to stop. You know, probably is how long it would take to burn up, but you know, it's Christmas, it's fine. Uh, I think we're just gonna have a little bit more of a stroll now and then head back to the hotel. Good evening, everyone. So we're just about to head out. I'm actually feeling quite tired. We've been walking around all day. Um, we went for a drink later on at um, a little pub. Uh, and then yeah came back here had a little nap and got ready to come out so we're gonna go to i think it's called what after eight o'clock eight o'clock as in eight as in ate o'clock if we can get in hopefully we can this is what i'm wearing because it is so cold outside i feel like the way to dress up your warm clothes is just by adding a pair of earrings as simple as that so these are from mango uh, yeah, they're from Mango, but I'm not sure they're in stock actually. And then I've got this jumper on from H&M. Let's go to the mirror of outfits. It's not the best light actually. That's because I had the light turned right down. Uh, yeah, so this jumper that I was wearing the other day by H&M. By H&M? From H&M. My Mango jeans again. And then a thing, I'm just going to pop my kitten heel boots with it and a very, very big scarf. And I've got my Uniqlo thermals underneath. It's the Heat Tech one. I actually saw, um, oh, I'm going to turn down service lady came. Um, but I said we didn't need it. Um, what was I saying? Oh, yeah, I saw Emma Hill talking about the um, thermal Uniqlo Heat Tech thermals so i went and got one and wow it is so soft i got the long sleeve version in the like medium strength warmth um yeah so this is just what i'm wearing i actually did a styling video in this but um it's really cold today really really cold but nice and fresh are you hungry I feel like we've just been nibbling sweets just all afternoon. <laughs> you could always. I actually think I could do with something savoury because I've eaten so much sugar. I need something to counteract it. Doors closing. <laughs> I do love after eight. I had about ten the other day. Um, I've gone for a brie starter, baked brie. Tim has got his calamari that he always has. Delicious. Oh, sorry. I have no idea. Chicken wing. I thought it looked like weird calamari, but I didn't take a proper look at it. I was just sort of looking at it through the camera. I'm telling you right now. Chicken wing. I thought it looked like weird calamari. I forgot you didn't have that. Then I've told lies. I can only hope that Santa Claus and my records agree. Then maybe. Double. Oh, that looks really ugly. Two burgers. Blueberry on top. What was I talking about before? After eight, I can't see it through the camera. It's day three in York. But what are we doing, Lydia? Packing. We're, we're packing. Well, we're not going home. This, yet. Is, this is how Lydia leaves her hotel room. Absolutely immaculate. <laughs> it looks better than when we came. I know, but you've got to do this. Got to do your bit. This hat is a little bit itchy and I've got something in my eye. I'm going for the all black look today, obviously. Got my uh, Zara's on that I've been wearing the whole time. So comfortable, I couldn't recommend enough. Zara trousers, Zara belt, a soft jumper, yeah, from weekday that I wore the other night. 
Um, same red lipstick on that I wore the other night. Um, scarf from ASOS and hat from ASOS. Just symbolising the Black Death. Beware. I have found the perfect tree and just it to the night. I've even made little gingerbread centers. There's nothing left to chance. This year, Santa's coming home to me. at Brew and Brownie which was delicious. Had scrambled both had scrambled eggs actually. Um, we're just going for a walk now. We might go and visit the castle and then we'll be more shopping or walking around. And we've come to the museum. This is the Victorian Street. So we've just been to York Castle Museum, which is behind us. What did you think? Yeah, it was lovely. It was really good. I, I went to it before when I was younger and there's like a real Victorian street there. I think it would be really good if you had children actually, but also adults as well. Um, but there's like a whole toy section on like vintage toys and they've got like kind of real set up houses and like, um, diary entries of people who would live in that kind of house um, and then the whole Victorian street setting it is actually really interesting um, and then they've got a whole section on First World War but yeah I think definitely worth a visit if you're in York it's a very good museum um, and now where are we going to find some mulled wine <laughs> find some mulled wine I think again it's really cold today and really foggy as you can probably tell. It's very atmospheric and wintry though. My hair's completely dropped. It was curly before and now it's as straight as a post. But yeah, I'm glad I'm wrapped up even though I'm still a bit cold but nice and festive. <laughs> in the background it's because Tim is vlogging no he's not vlogging he is editing this very vlog actually um so I thought I'd just do a quick sign off because um when we we're in York yesterday it seemed a bit um it wasn't rushed but I, I didn't really have the chance to do like a goodbye part of the vlog I'm sorry there's that music on in the background there's the washing machine on in the background uh, today this morning anyway 
I think it's about 11, but it's been much, very much a sorting out kind of morning. Um, just getting everything organised, sorting the washing out, cleaning the house, tying up last minute work things. Um, so yeah, ready for Christmas now. Um, but thank you so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed the York vlog. Um, couldn't recommend the Grand Hotel enough. Really, really enjoyed our stay there. And just our whole time there really was really lovely. We were kind of very lucky with the weather but also just everything was so nice about it i always recommend york it's a city that i absolutely love so if you do get the chance to go definitely do so thank you so much for watching i'll see you in my next vlog don't forget to hit the subscribe button i hope you're enjoying vlogmas so far um i think the york vlog will probably be the best vlogmas in my opinion anyway thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in the next one